Hello everyone, this is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. Today I will be showing you how to use the Windows Startup Prepare tool to fix some common startup problems that may be prohibiting you from getting into your main Windows operating system. What Startup Prepare is, it's basically a Windows recovery tool that can fix certain system problems that would be preventing Windows from starting. Now it's one of several recovery tools we have at our disposal but I always recommend that this should be one of your first steps to figuring out what is wrong with your computer. Now what I've actually done is I've burned the Windows 10 ISO file to a CD and I'm going to boot the computer from that because I believe in this situation most people will not be able to to log into Windows. This is a workaround for that. I will put a link in the description of this video for my other video in which I just talk about creating an installation media disk for Windows 10. So you're going to want to boot to that. So at this point right now I have already gone into my boot menu by tapping on the escape key when the computer was starting up. I'm going to scroll down to CD-ROM drive so I'm going to click enter once I am highlighted over that. Now it says press any key to boot from CD or DVD. You just press any key. Okay so now under Windows Setup just make sure the language install is correct. Doesn't really matter for what we're doing but just click on next. And now instead of clicking install now go over to the bottom left corner of this window where it says repair your computer and left click on that. Now under choose an option, left click on troubleshoot, now left click on advanced options, and now left click on start or prepare. Under choose a target operating system, left click on Windows 10. Now this tool might take a few minutes to run. Under Startup Prepare, we choose an account to continue with. This is the user account in which I am normally logged into, so I will click on that. Enter your password. Alright, so we can see Startup Repair couldn't repair your PC because our computer is not having any problems starting up. That's probably why we're getting this. In the event that you are still unable to boot into your Windows computer, there are still other options you can explore to get your Windows computer back up and running. I have already done a tutorial of how to run automatic repair, and that is another possibility. And just like Startup Repair, none of this is a guarantee because well, there's a lot of different possibilities as to what is causing your computer not to be able to start up. It might not be a software issue like we are looking into. It could be a hardware issue and that would be a completely different situation you'd be dealing with. So also you can check out this log file if you opened up a command prompt through this tool you could see what is perhaps causing any error. It's also another feature that's really underlooked in this system repair arsenal. So anyway, I hope I helped you out guys, and I will see you in the next tutorial.